Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I am just going to bring you along with me and show you what I'm doing today. I am going to finish painting the trim in my living room. I have done everywhere but along this wall and that wall. And then I have to go over that over here. Um, I think I have just enough to finish the living room. I'd like to do the rest of the house, but I'd have to get some more of that. But today I'm going to finish in here. So um, this is what I've done. I've done over here. I did this door. I need to touch up a couple of spots like right there. Um, I got to do all along here and all through here. Um, I'm not going to do the trim around the window. I haven't decided if I want to do that. So I'm going to hold off on it for now. But I have done the rest of the like trim down the hallway over here, um, throughout the kitchen too. But um, I'd like to do the trim around the doors and do the doors, but I'll need a lot more paint for that. But I figured, but I figured that I would just bring you guys along with me and I hope you guys enjoy this video. I've seen a lot of change, been through a lot of pain. Some things are not the same as they were a year ago But all will be okay I move on each and every day The past is where it stays Way back a year ago I've changed for the better this time I thought I would never be fine I strive just to say I'm alright And for the first time in a long time I'm alright I've seen a lot of change Been through a lot of pain Some things are not the same As they were a year ago But all will be okay I move on each and every day The past is where it stays Way back a year ago Back a year ago So I've finished this wall. I just need to do a second coat on it. And then I'm going to let it dry before I start on that wall. Because, I mean, as you know, my living room is very tiny. Ignore that mess over there. Um, I can't pull this stuff out with this stuff here. So I'm going to let this dry so I can put all this back. So I can move the TV stand out. But that's what it's looking like so far if you can see it yeah there we go i'm just gonna let it dry do a second coat and then let that dry and then move all my stuff back and then do that wall over there and then i will be done with this with the living room at least like i said i'd like to do all the baseboards in the house like the bedrooms all of it but yeah So while that is drying, I'm going to put this laundry up, put the rest of the laundry that's in the washer in the dryer, 
and get some other things done while that's drying. Back a year ago For 29 and I find myself wondering What did happen to the last 10 I ran away with my life fast forward Never turned back again it's kind of funny that the more we pass time, the more we need to set the rewind. And 19 was the year I had to leave you, but now I'm seeing all the signs. Is this really happening? I can't believe it's true. I'm just as surprised as you. Is this okay, so I got this wall done, second coat on, it's dried. I'm going to move all this stuff back so that I can move the TV out and do that wall. And then I will be done. Something from nothing. I sit here looking for an answer. Maybe the biggest question was in the last chapter. You gave me the soul I have today. Without you, I never could have moved away. But now I see what you teach. I do believe I always should have stayed. Yeah. Is this really happening? I can't believe it's true. I'm just this surprised as you. So I've done one coat and um, I'm hoping that tape is holding up because I've got paint all over it. So when I peel it off, I hope it doesn't tear anything up. But uh, I'm going to let it dry and then I'm going to do another coat. I also need to sweep back here before I put the TV stand back because it is dusty. And I got a little bit of paint right there, but it'll come up. So this is probably a weird angle, but... Um I finished the living room. I'll have to show you when I get back home. I didn't film the rest of it. My phone was gone. And that's what I record on. But uh, I had a wild hair and decided to redo my fireplace too. So I did one coat of paint on it. And I have to do another coat when I get back. But it is 112 and I have to go pick my youngest one, Zane, up from preschool. He gets out at 1.30, so I'm just heading there to get him, and I thought I would just update you guys on what I was doing, since I uh, haven't pulled the camera out in a little while, but I will show you the baseboards when I get back, and I'll show you what I'm doing to the fireplace. 
So I forgot to show you all before I put everything back um, how it looks. I don't know if you can see back there. But I think it turned out really good. And then I decided to redo my fireplace. It was white. It's still wet. And I painted it black because I had a little bit of paint left over from that. And it looked awful. So I had this, like a, I'm not even sure the color of it. It's called clay mask. And uh, it's wet, so you can't really tell the color of it. But it's like a dark, not a dark. <laughs> it's like a light gray, greenish color when it dries. But I think I actually like this. It gives it a bit of a different color in here. But that's how it turned out. It's still wet, so everything's still all over the floor. But I really like it. I really wish I could do my living room some other way. But my living room is so small, y'all. Like, it's like this big. And then you have a little bit of this over here. But, I mean, the door is there, so you can't really put nothing there because then it'll be in the way. But I don't know. I still don't even know where we're going to put our Christmas tree at this year. But we'll figure that out when the time comes, I guess. Okay, so it is the next day. Um, I didn't do much the day before. So I thought I would just keep filming into the next day. But let's just get into it. Okay, so I'm making barbecue chicken sandwiches tonight in the crock pot because we're not going to get home till late. I got one that's got soccer, two that's got soccer, one that's got basketball. So I am just going to throw this in the crock pot. I'm going to season, my chicken's already in there, so I'm just going to season it. Throw some onions in there. And then I'm just going to cover it and let it cook on low for a few hours and then we'll see what it looks like. Okay, so I want to attempt to make a sourdough starter and I don't know if I'm going to do this right, but we are going to try anyways. So the TikTok I watched called for a half a cup of flour. And then a Woo! I just spilled that. Half a cup of water. And then she said Okay, she said to mix it really good. And I guess that's it. Um, she just said to cover it, and then I guess check it tomorrow. All 
Okay, I can't find a bigger rubber band, so we're just gonna go with this. Okay. And then I guess I set it in a warm place and then check back on it tomorrow. So I guess that's all I need to do. Um, I have only done this once before and it did not turn out at all. So if you have any tips on sourdough starter, um, just let me know in the comments below. I would greatly appreciate it. So I had to run in Walmart for a couple things and I thought I would just show you. It's literally such a small little haul, but I figured I'd show you anyways. Um, I got two things of bread. We have soccer Saturday and we have one game early and then we have a whole hour in between before the next game. So we thought we would just pack some sandwiches for the car so we don't have to leave and then come back in and pay again to park. So we got bread. We got some grapes. We needed some more strawberries. The kids have already ate all the strawberries that I got from the last grocery haul, um, which was just Monday, I think. I don't know. It was one day this week. Bologna, some turkey, some fries to go with our barbecue chicken sandwiches tonight. I got cream cheese. It's for um, a recipe. Like I think it's... It's the garlic parmesan chicken pasta. I think that's what it's called. But it calls for that. Um, we got some cheese. Some spaghetti noodles. We got uh, tomato and basil garlic spaghetti sauce. This is for that garlic parmesan chicken recipe. We, I needed some taco shells for taco knot. Um some drumsticks, and then a bag of chips. That's going to be it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, I know it's a little all over the place, but I thought I would go ahead and post it anyways. But I will see you guys next time. Thank you so much for watching. They ain't looking inside for their needs in life They wanna be like by everybody in sight But trust me, being free ain't slide lights No, it's long nights and it's long fights With yourself all the time to get your mind right But if you put in the work, you can find the light, alright? I'll do it